Hello, my name is Amen St. Cyr, and I am an Assistant District Attorney in Jefferson Parish who screens family violence cases. In addition to prosecuting domestic violence offenders, our office takes a proactive approach to better protect victims of domestic violence by seeking changes in state law. Today, I'm going to talk to you about Senate Bill 66, which became Act 75 when Governor John Bell Edwards signed it into law. This bill increases the penalties for violation of a restraining order when the offender violates the restraining order by going to the victim's residence, school, or workplace while in possession of a firearm. Louisiana already has laws in place to issue restraining orders to protect victims of domestic violence to prosecute offenders who violate a restraining order. However, the Jefferson Parish District Attorney's Office believed that the penalty for violating a restraining order while in possession of a firearm needed to be increased if an offender went to a protected person's home, office, or school with a firearm because of the threat to the protected person's safety given how quickly these situations often escalate. Tragically, sometimes today's misdemeanor domestic violence crime could be tomorrow's domestic violence homicide. This bill increases the penalty to make this offense a felony crime of violence. We are grateful for the hard work of our legislators and special thanks to Senator Pat Connor for putting forth this bill for the Jefferson Parish District Attorney's Office and to Representative Debbie Villio for her assistance when this bill reached the House of Representatives. Thank you, and we are honored to serve you.